of the last two sections of this surah. And they are depicting, you know, a scene of the day of judgment. What is going to happen on the day of judgment. As we have read, you know, in Surah Al-Nisa, فَكَيْفَ إِذَا جَيْنَا مِنْ كُلِّ أُمَّةٍ بِشَهِيدٍ The prophets which were, who were sent to different nations and tribes, they will stand up in the court of Allah and they will testify as the prosecution witnesses, as the court witnesses as we call them. But even you know those prophets, how they will behave before Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. How humble will they be? And especially in case of Jesus Christ, whom people have taken to be a part of Godhead. What will be his attitude on the day of judgment before Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? So these two sections, last sections of this surah are very important. Yawma yajma'ullahu rusula. Think of the day when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will gather all the messengers. فَيَقُولُ مَاذَا عُجِبْتُمْ and he will ask them, what response was given to you by your people? قَالُوا لَا عِلْمَ لَنَا إِنَّكَ أَنْتَ عَلَّامُ الْغُيُوبِ This is the humility. They will say, oh Allah, we don't have any definite knowledge. You are the only one who knows all the unseen. You know it. What was the response? What people said to us? You know everything. We can't add to your knowledge. You already know it. It's called Allah, Ya Isa. Um, now you know, especially Hazrat Isa alayhi salatu wasalam. Just recall when Allah will say to Isa, Ya Isa, O Isa ibn Maryam, son of Mary, Usku ni'mati alayk. Just recall and remember my blessings upon you. Wa ala walidatik. And upon your mother. Is When I strengthened you through the Holy Ghost, Holy Spirit, to So that you spoke to the people in the cradle as an infant. And you spoke also as an old man in old age. Now this word here is very important. Kahala. According to the history, Jesus was raised or lifted from this earth to heaven and it is accepted by all the Christians at the age of 33. This is not Kahulat. Even at the age of 40, it is Shab, according to Arabic language. Kahul, Kahl means old age. This means old age will come to Hazrat Jesus, Hazrat Masih alayhi salam. When he returns to this earth, and this is given by Hadith, he will come back, then he will marry, he will have children, and then he will die. And perhaps he will remain on earth for 40 long years. So 40 plus 33 go to make 73. Now this is old age. Otherwise this word cannot be explained. Now this is a point for those who don't believe in the second coming of Jesus. There are so many people among the Muslims who don't give any importance to ahadith. And these things, you know, which appear to them to be against scientific phenomena. How can a person come again and how can a person remain alive in the heaven for 2000 long years? Because these things are unusual. These are miraculous. Even his birth was miraculous. Without father. He was given the biggest miracles. The palpable, the seen miracles. Which can be seen with the eyes. The biggest miracle is Quran. But this is not something to be seen with eyes. It is to be understood through your intellect and heart. The biggest visible miracles were given to Hazrat Masih. And there is a list coming. Tukallimun nasa fil mahdi wa kahla. Wa izadlam tukal kitaba wal hikmata wal taurata wal injil. These four words appeared in Surah Al Imran also. And the relationship is, is Allah Tukal Kitab. When I taught you the book, 
and wal hikmah and the wisdom wat taurat aur injil here now waw is waw tafsiri to explain that is the torah and the injil torah was the book the law and and injil is the wisdom there is no law in injil is allam to kal kitab wal hikmat wat taurat aur injil when i taught you the book and the wisdom that is the torah and the injil by stakhluqu bin at-tin kahat at-tayr and when you used to make from clay the likeliness of a bird fatanfuhu fihi bi izni and with my command fatanfuhu fiha fatakunu tayran bi izni and then you breathed into it and it used to become a a a bird a real bird with on my command by my command batubri ul akmaha wal abrasa and you corrected and you healed the born blind and the leper bizni by my command wa istakhrujo wa istakhrujo al mauta bizni and when you revived the dead by my command wa iskafaftu bani israil an and when we and when i hold, held back the hands of bani israil from you they were bent upon killing you crucifying you i caught their hands i saved you is jaitahum bil bayyanat when you came to them with clear teachings and clear miracles fa qala alladhina kafaru minhum in hadha illa sihru mubin then those of them who disbelieved they said oh it is clear sorcery this magic and nothing else wa iza wa iz awhaytu ila alafariyin an aminu bi wa bi rasuli and just recall oh jesus when i inspired the hawariyin your companions that have faith in me and in my messenger this is inspiration is awhaytu here wahi is inspiration wahi of the book is revelation so these two words are separate inspirate qalu amanna wa ashhadu bi anna muslimun bi anna muslimun they said we we believe so you be a witness to us that we are we submit ourselves to allah is qalu al hawariyun now another incident is qalu al hawariyun and just recall when these hawariyin these companions of jesus asked him ya isa ibn maryam o isa son of maryam hal yastati o rabbuka an yunazzil alaina ma'idatan min as-sama is your lord capable of sending down on us a table spread with food a table served on it food qala taqulla jesus said have fear of allah have regard for allah don't ask such ridiculous you know demands from him in kuntum mu'minin if you are true believers qalu nuridu an naakula minha they insisted we 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 want to eat from that table which comes directly from the heaven but tatma'inna qulubuna and so that our hearts become absolutely satisfied now these are the words which even hazrat ibrahim said so don't blame these hawariyin when you know we find it in surah al baqarah hazrat ibrahim prayed to allah are ni kaifa tuhil mata o allah show me how you will revive the dead qala walam tu'min allah said don't you believe qala bala walakin layat mayna qalbi i do believe but i want that my heart should be absolutely you know convinced of it so the hawariyin also said qalu nuridu an naakula minha wa tatma'inna qulubuna wa na'lama and we shall come to know for sure an qad sadaqtana that whatever you told us whatever you said to us was absolutely true and correct wa nakuna alaiha min ash-shahidin and then we shall become on that witnesses because you know to be actually 
witnesses for Allah. You need a very deep conviction to become a real soldier of Allah on earth. You know, a shallow faith cannot give you the courage. You need a very deep conviction to be ready to sacrifice everything for the sake of Allah. Not easy. To read the ayah, it's very easy. In the last tara min al mu'minin al futam wa mala bi anna laul jannah. You can repeat it thousand times. But to be able to prove to it, equal to it, is not easy. So you need the depth of commitment, the depth of conviction. Kala Isa, now Isa, acceded to their request. Kala Isa ibn Maryam, so said Jesus, son of Mary, Allahumma, O oh God, O oh Allah, Rabbana, O oh our sustainer, our Lord, Anzil alayna ma'ilata min as Send down upon us a table from the skies, from the heaven. Takunu lana idan li awwalina wa akhirna. So that it becomes for us a recurring, returning festival. Just as we have Eid al-Fitr and Eid al-Azha. So this will become for my ummah. The remembrance of this day will become the Eid. Li awwalina wa akhirna. From the people who are before and people who are coming to be later. From the first of us and the last of us. And it will become a sign from you. And feed us. And you are the best feeder. Allah said, I am going to send it down on you. But now, from man yakfur ba'd minkum, but listen, whosoever of you will disbelieve after this, after seeing such a clear sign, such a clear miracle, if now this responsibility becomes much great, after showing a clear miracle, you know, no concession is given to the people now. When you know the people of Saleh demanded a miracle, a pregnant camel should come out from this rock if you are the messenger of Allah. A she camel, pregnant she camel should come down, come out from this rock and this was given to them. But then now, if now you don't believe, then there can be no concession. All finished. So the same is the style here. فَمَنْ يَكْفُرْ بَعْدُ مِنْكُمْ فَإِنِّي وَعَزَّبُهُ عَزَابًا لَا وَعَزَّبُهُ أَحَدًا مِنَ الْعَالَمِينَ Then I will give the punishment which, to him which I will not give to any from all the worlds. This will be the most severe punishment that I will give them. Having seen such an open miracle with their eyes. 